She was shot and killed while sitting inside of her own house. It's been five years since Katie Ferguson's life was cut short and police have not cracked the case. Her family and friends are frustrated and want answers. Here's this week's case files. It was the evening of January 3rd, 2017. Katie Ferguson was sitting in her front room reading. Police say just after 8.30, someone fired multiple shots into the bay window, hitting the 40-year-old mother. Katie's daughters, who were 10 and 16 at the time, along with her oldest daughter's boyfriend, were inside the house when the shooting happened. Ferguson was rushed to the hospital where she died. The way that it happened and the, the way the bullets traveled and the short distance they traveled, it was definitely very intentional. Like they got out of that vehicle with the intention to kill somebody. Police do not believe Katie was the intended target that night, but the reason for the crime remains a mystery. Katie's best friend, Jen, describes her as someone you could always count on. She was the head of our family. She was the person that tied all the bonds and kept us all together and just kind of kept everybody grounded and centered. You know, if somebody had a problem, they turned to her. Jen says it's frustrating watching Katie's daughters grow up while navigating the grief of losing their mom. And to make matters worse, there's no movement in the case. We've gotten absolutely no answers at all. While family and friends are healing, they're hopeful that someday her children have the piece of the puzzle that can answer the burning question of why. To be on the emotional end of it and have two little girls who had a mother taken away from them and see such a traumatic scene and see her taken away. And, and more than anything, I want someone to come forward because they need justice. For this week's Case Files, Christina Williams, 13 ABC Action News. And if you have any information about the homicide of Catherine Katie Ferguson, you can call or text Crime Stopper. That number is 419-255-1111. You could be eligible for a cash reward. And if you have an unsolved case that needs attention, email me, casefiles at 13abc.com.